Mobile police arrest six homeless men overnight at Gulf Quest. The city tells News 5 it's an effort to control downtown's homeless problem following the brutal attack on a woman in a parking garage earlier this month. News 5's Mary Smith joins us now live downtown. Mary, how do downtown patrons feel about this new effort? Well, Roseanne and Devin, everyone I talked to seem to agree with the city of Mobile that there is a homelessness problem, and they just can't seem to agree on how to address that problem. Six men booked into Metro Jail all around the same time, all for the same violation. We noticed all were listed as homeless, so we reached out to the city to investigate, and we learned it's part of an effort to crack down on homelessness in downtown. The heightened enforcement is actually in response to a heightened fear or safety issue in the downtown area, and I think that was really brought to light with the recent attack. And that recent attack was the brutal beating and attempted rape of a woman in the RSA parking garage earlier this month. Police charged Douglas Dunson, a homeless man arrested over two dozen times here in Mobile County. Safety Director Barber says the city has beefed up security, putting more officers on the clock in the downtown precinct. You know, a lot of people want to be able to walk down the sidewalk without being harassed, and we're trying to make sure that people move about freely and feel safe. I think the city is doing what it can within the constraints of their budget and within the constraints of their manpower. Others say arresting them is a temporary fix to what feels like a permanent problem. That doesn't solve anything, you know, but we can try to put things in place where it help them get back on their feet. And Barbara does tell me a lot of those charges that they're being arrested for are indecent exposure, public intoxication, and urination, and trespassing. Reporting live in downtown Mobile, Mary Smith, WKRG News 5.